All right, pedal to the metal. It never ends. We're in the Pratt Pack gym. Moon River. There he is, Henry Mancini from West Aliquippa. What a talent. What a talent. Don't you just wish sometimes you could sit down and play a piano like this guy? Do great work. Lincoln Park, of course, the Henry Mancini All-Stars. Who knows? Maybe the next Henry Mancini. Now listen, here's some things that we need to talk about. First off, AccuWeather, it's cold, very cold. How long will it last? We're going to get some snow this weekend. We'll have the AccuWeather forecast for you from those good folks. No one plans your day better. Saturday and Sunday morning on Rob Pratt Sunday. But right now, how about the drive through at the Brighton Hot Dog Shop for a little chili? That sounds pretty good before I head off to CBS Radio World Headquarters in Green Tree. Getting ready for the big travel showcase this weekend at the David L. Lawrence Convention Center starting today and running through Sunday with the good folks at AAA Central. I'll tell you more about that in a moment. NFL Network, as you can see, always on in the Pratt Pack Gym. Tomorrow, it will be the Senior Bowl in Mobile, Alabama at 2.30. And then Sunday on ESPN, it's the Pro Bowl, Super Bowl 51 next week on Fox. Next Sunday at 6.30, Lady Gaga will be performing. Now, the Pens lost to Boston 4-3. Brad Martian had two goals, and it was Schultz, Kessel, and Hornquist scoring for the Pens. Pens, of course, in the entire NHL getting ready for the big weekend All-Star festivities, skills competition, the game itself on Sunday at the incredible Staples Center. Gretzky will be there, as will Lemieux. A lot of photo ops, two of the greatest ever in the game. Royalty of the ice, Wayne Gretzky and Mario Lemieux. It's just a great weekend for the biggest stars on ice, past and present, to gather and salute the great game that is the NHL. College basketball, tomorrow you've got Pitt hosting Clemson at noon, the Peterson Event Center. You can hear it at 93.7, the fan with Hillgrove and Grote. Panthers struggling a little bit right now, 12-8. and 8. Robert Moore is looking for their eighth win on the year. will be at St. Francis of Pennsylvania tomorrow at 7. Duquesne Dukes will be at Richmond tomorrow at 6. Penn State is hosting Illinois at 4.30. And WVU will host uh, Texas A&M at the West Virginia University Coliseum at noon. The Cavs, who've been struggling, they've lost six of the last eight. LeBron James says too top-heavy is the lineup. We need some more playmakers. Well, tonight they will host uh, Brooklyn and... Uh, Hopefully, the Cavs can start to find some answers. They are still in first place in the Central Division. They've got 30 wins on the year. Now, the Farmers Insurance Open began yesterday at Torrey Pines in the North Course, and it was Justin Rose opening with a 765. He has a one-shot lead. Everybody's been talking about Tiger's return. He opened with a 76. Give him some time, folks. Give him some time. Um, also, uh, what are we going to be doing tomorrow as far as open talk on Rob Pratt Saturday after CBS Radio News Gets us started at 5 a.m. I want to talk about the first seven days of Donald Trump. And forget about this whole first 100 days. I mean, he has done a whole lot of stuff. But the question is, will his executive action stick? He has been a man of action, but he has also, many people believe, been an unpredictable president. He's put the world on notice. And by the way, happening right now, the incredible March for Life, my daughter, representing Quigley Catholic, happens to be in the nation's capital. This thing has been going on since 1974. We're going to talk about that tomorrow as well. Now, our president is going to be in the Hall of Heroes at the Department of Defense because he's got some executive orders he's going to sign at 4.30 Eastern today. Um, one of them is to limit the amount of refugees flowing into the United States and also some military readiness orders he'll be signing as well today. Um, now, the rest of the program tomorrow, along with your AccuWeather and your sports beginning at 5.15 and every half hour until 7.45, is as follows. Service Master, furnace issues, water issues, smoke issues. Listen, I have used them many times, and I am a big believer in Service Master. And when you see the yellow van going through your neighborhood, you know somebody is going to be getting the best. So we're going to talk about Service Master and give you a chance to hear all of the amazing things that they do. So don't miss the 7 o'clock hour Pittsburgh Works. And then, once again, the great brand that is Rorick Automotive. The Rorick Automotive Hour. Absolutely love what they do. We'll be talking automobiles. And that's good. And we'll be discussing it from 8 until 9. And then Dr. Ray Wisniewski, the man that guarantees 20 pounds. But people, and you hear those success stories every week on KDK, have lost a whole lot more than that. Nutrimos.com is where you can find out more. Go to their Facebook page. You can link into it right here. Dr. Ray Wisniewski between 9 and 10 tomorrow morning. 
And then, through the magic of radio, right after the 10 o'clock CBS Radio News, it'll be the True Value Home Improvement Show, live from the Pittsburgh Travel Showcase at the incredible David L. Lawrence Convention Center. And then, right after that, a two-hour edition of AAA East Central's Talking Travel. We will highlight so much of this wonderful event, 100,000 square feet of nothing but everything the AAA brand does. We invite you to get down there today tomorrow or Sunday. I will be there as well after I get off the air at one o'clock doing some introductions of some of the wonderful people that'll be really informing and entertaining you throughout this three-day period. So have a great day, stay warm, and we will talk to you later. Of course, a big weekend, PittsburghTravelShowcase.com. Don't you think it's time that you get out of the cold? Cheers. <music>